Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Michelle with Couponing in Maine. I am off to Walmart today. There's a bunch of different nice deals that I'm interested in getting. I am working, attempting to work towards my 140 rebate bonus for $45 back. Um, I don't think I'm going to hit that. But as if I believe it was yesterday, I got a, another bonus on Ibotta. Eight offers for $1. It's not a great deal, but <clears throat> there's stuff that I need. My daughter wants to try some spray deodorant. She's actually out of deodorant, so it's a great time. I'm going to head to Walmart and pick some up. Um, I might hit CVS. I was going to do the spray deodorant deal at CVS, but it's cheaper for me to do it at Walmart. Um, my mom uses um, Suave Shampoo, Suave Professionals, so I'm going to pick that up with Ibotta. Um, if you don't know what Ibotta is, it is a rebate app that gives you money back for purchasing items. All you do is you buy the items and you uh, scan the receipt and they give you money back. Super easy, I will put my link in the comments below. You can use my link, it'll give you, I believe it's $10 to start out with. Um, so I only have about an hour before I have to pick up my kids from school while well, my daughter's from at play practice and my boys went to after, after, after care to play with their friends. So I have about an hour and 15 minutes drive time and shop time. Um, I also have to stand in line at Walmart to return something that I ordered for a Christmas gift, but we're now no longer doing Christmas gifts. We're just going to do a Yankee swap. So now I got to go return that, pick up dinner items, and try and get some of my bonuses or rebates done. Um, so come shop with me and uh, let's see what I pick up. Okay, because I'm working on the... I bought her bonus. My daughter wants to try the, the deodorant spray. They are six eighteen, and I bought her's gonna give me back two dollars and fifty cents. So we're gonna give it a go. I'm gonna pick up the Suave deodorant. It is two ninety four. I bought her's giving back two dollars, making this just ninety four cents. And this is the kind of shampoo that my mom uses. So I'm gonna pick this up. I'm going to pay ninety two ninety four in the store and submit my receipt to Ibotta to get back $2 to so pay $0.94. Cents. So I'm going to pick up this Nivea lotion. It's $5.84. I have this $2 printable coupon making it $3.84. I bought it's going to give me back $2.50. I'm going to pay a dollar. Well, I'm going to submit it to Ibotta and it'll eventually be $1.34. So it'll be $5.84 is what, I'm, it's what it retails for. I'm gonna pay two dollars for take two dollars off, so it'll be five dollars minus two will be three eighty four. I'm gonna pay in the store. I'm gonna get two fifty off from my bought it and pay a dollar thirty four. Okay, so I am in Walmart in the cereal aisle, and there is a whole bunch of clearance cereal. Um, down here at the cornflakes, they're a dollar nineteen for twelve ounce. I'm going to use this dollar off three coupon that came from our insert. So it'll be three twenty-four. You think about three sixty minus one of these will be two sixty for three twelve-ounce boxes of cornflakes. So my next item is this Quaker dinosaur egg oatmeal. I'm not to eat them, and my kids won't eat them, but they are two fifty. I have this dollar off coupon, making them a dollar fifty. I'll pay a dollar fifty here in the store. I'll submit to Ibotta for a dollar fifty, making them completely free, and I'm going to donate this. Okay, so. I'm gonna try these Fruity Fun. I've we've never tried them. They're two ninety four. Have this coupon that we got in this past Sunday's paper for a dollar off, making them a dollar ninety four. I'm gonna pay that here in the store, and I'm gonna submit to Ibotta for a dollar off, making them ninety four cents. This is something the kids it's healthier for the kids than chocolate, so we're gonna give this a try. Okay, so I'm gonna pick up this hot cocoa. It's a dollar ninety two. You have to buy two and you will get a dollar rebate from Ibotta. I'm buying four, I'm gonna give two as a present and then I'm gonna put two into a Yankee Swap gift that we're doing at home with my family and my kids and this is a perfect thing for that. Okay, so this is what my cart looks like. I always film everything because I'm not super extreme and I am living life and I had to pick up stuff for dinners and snacks and we're trying to diet and we're in a weight loss competition so this is what my cart looks like some of us that I do not have coupons for i eat the vegetables and dinner stuff and then all of those cereals but i got them because they're cheap let's go to the cash register 
All right, we're back from Walmart and I did make a quick trip to CVS. This is everything that I picked up. Well, not everything. I did pick up um, dinner items. So the Old El Paso taco kits, I did not coupon for, but that was dinner. They're already been used, but I put them up there anyhow. Um, so I did get that. We got some taco cheese and lettuce tomatoes. Um, I did not include that in this. Um, but this entire haul here, all of this was a total of $47.27. And after my I bought a rebate, I got $10.10 back from Ibotta from a rebate and oh nope as I'm filming this it's telling me Ibotta is coming back to me saying I got earned $11.10 which means um all of this totaled $46.27 so my total cost for all of this was only $35.17 so, I actually used, I paid nothing out of pocket at Walmart for this because I used, well, I had my Ibotta money that I've earned, my rebate money. I opened up a PayPal account and sent that money to my PayPal. So, I used my PayPal debit card to pay for this. So, I used my couponing money and I recycled it back and purchased these items. Um... So let's go through this. So I'm gonna start over here with the Pop Tarts and such. This is what we, this is CVS. So um, last time I went to CVS, there was a little snafu and somehow, some way, I had extra bucks that went to an old card or an old account of mine that I did not use anymore. Same phone number, but a different account. So I had to give them my phone number today because they had $4 extra bucks no nine dollars extra bucks that i had on there so i said you know what better way to use it than to get something that i'm not going to get extra care bucks back for so the pop tarts this week are dollar 99 each i had a dollar off two so i used two of those they were printables so i paid three dollars for a set of two so six dollars for both and then the gum was buy two get one free so at CVS, I used um, two Kellogg's Pop-Tart, buy one, buy two, get a dollar off. I used two of those coupons and nothing for the Trident. Um, and I did give them both all my, both my um, extra care bucks, e equaling $9. Um, but so the total out of pocket for this these seven items right here at CVS was $11 out of my own pocket. And then my second transaction was with my actual account that I use all the time with my extra care bucks and all of my coupons. I had a $5 off one Revlon product. The, this is $5.99. So using that coupon, I only paid 99 cents for this. Well, let me double check. Yes, 99 cents for this. And I think I may have screwed up, screwed up. On this account, I had a dollar off to um, Nature Valley. So Nature Valley is $1.99 today, and we eat this. I did not see another one of the crunchy bars, uh, but this here, this is something we've never had. This is peanut butter biscuits. This is also $1.99. So I use the digital coupon on my CVS card. Um, and I, it only took off 50 cents. So I don't know if it took off, if it took this here into account. I'm not quite sure. However, um, the 50 cents off and the $5 off, the total that I paid was $5, two cents for those three items. So really all of these CVS items came to a total of $5 and 13 cents, which I don't think is a bad haul at all. Then we get to what I purchased here at Walmart. So my Walmart trip really, well, I am trying to see if I can hit that $140 rebate and get 45, I think it's $45 back. Not sure that's gonna happen, 
but my daughter is out of deodorant. She's asked me for spray on deodorant. I was going to go to CVS, but after I did it all in my head and figured out the cost at both, Walmart was cheaper even with the $3 extra care box that um, they're giving out for the um, spray deodorant this week at CVS. I really was going to get degree, but by the time I got to Walmart today, the degree rebate on Ibotta was no longer there, so I went with Dove because the rebate was still there. So this was, I believe it was like six, um, 6.18 and I had a dollar, no, I want to say it was a dollar fifty or two dollars off Dove. I can't really remember, but it was a dollar fifty or two dollars. So I purchased this and we'll see how that works. The Nivea, I found, whoops, the coupon um, online. I printed it off coupons.com. So the Nivea was four. I want to say it was no five eighty four. I had a two dollar printable, and it gave me two fifty off on Ibotta, making this a dollar eighty four. Back here is the Suave Professionals. My mother uses this um, as her go to shampoo, so I was happy to run to Walmart and pick this up for her. This was two ninety four. I had a two dollar Ibotta rebate. So I paid $2.94 in the store. I submitted $2 back to Ibotta, making this $0.94. Cents. These fruity ones, this is a new product for us. I've, we've never tried it. Um, I had a dollar off coupon for this. And I had $1.50 off on Ibotta. I believe this made it $0.94 cents for us. This here was not was not on Ibotta. This, we... We eat this ranch all the time. Um, so I bought two. I have had a coupon, which I thought was so good. It was not good. It was expired. So I paid, I believe they were $1.74 each um, in store with no rebate, no coupon. But we eat that. Um, I bought four Swiss Miss hot cocoa mix. Um, and when I submitted Ibotta, it only took two. It was a buy two. Um, so apparently you can't deal a do, do the deal twice. My fault. However, two of them are going in a Christmas gift. The other two I'm using for something else. These here I'm using in a Christmas gift. So they, they were cheap enough. They worked towards my bonus. And they're going in a Christmas gift. This dinosaur oatmeal. My kids will not eat it. No one in the house will eat it. I picked it up anyhow because I'm going to donate this. I can either donate it to a local food shelter in my my community or my kids, my boys school, the nurse has started a food pantry in her office for some of the families that they that they're helping. Um so I can either donate this to them or I can donate this to the food pantry. I started a little a little pile but this is $3, I believe. Let me just double check here. I believe this was $2.94. However, I had a dollar off coupon, making this $1.50, I believe. And on Ibotta, they gave me $1.50 back, making this completely free. This here, this Nature Valley granola, was 99 cents on clearance. Um, so I picked that up thinking, you know, I'm in a weight loss contest with some family members, thinking this will be a nice, a nice little boost every once in a while. Um, the Cheetos, that again is my mistake. They were each 98 cents. But I paid full price for both of them because by the time I got home, or maybe it wasn't there anymore, I don't know. But when I went to go submit the receipt, there was no rebate back for the Cheetos. So my kids will eat that or I can donate that. Now, these four cereals, I did not have a, well, I did have a coupon, but there was no rebate for. Um, my Walmart is clearancing out a lot of cereal. I had a dollar off three Kellogg's coupon. So I used that on the cornflakes. 
the cereal was a dollar, well, the cornflakes were a dollar 19 a piece. Um, and this here is Dunkaroo cereal, the General Mills. That was the last one on the shelf, and that one was a dollar 29. Um, no, a dollar 39. So I bought all four, and the, the cornflakes total $3.57. The Dungaroo was $1.39, making all three of them, all four of them, $4.96. With my dollar coupon, I only paid $3.96 for all four boxes of these cereal. So I don't think this was a really bad haul. Um, I'm never really good at going in and spending five, ten dollars or what other coupon um, people do, couponers do. I go in with the deals I'm going to do and I always end up spending more. However, like I said, I rolled my PayPal couponing I bought a box and paid with that. Um, but I'm pretty happy with this because we got dinner stuff, we got stocked up on some breakfast items, got some stocking Christmas present stuff. I got my mom her, what is this here? Shampoo, Christmas gift stuff here, um, stocking up on cereal, and my daughter her deodorant. So again, the entire, oh, and I forgot these right here. Got these. I'm not a chili fan. My parents like chili and my boys. So my parents will make chili. These were 94 cents, I believe. 96. Nope, they're 98 cents. I bought, I was giving 50 cents back off of one. So each of these came to 49, 48 cents a piece. So with winter coming, chili is a decent, quick, easy meal, I believe. They won't have to buy that. It'll be already here. So I stocked up on breakfast, um, Christmas stuff, Christmas gift, all Everything here on this table, minus the tacos, everything on this table, I only spent $36.17. And so that is the haul for tonight. That will finish the haul. Um, more than I was expecting to purchase, more than I was expecting to pay. Um, so for those of you who keep coming back and have subscribed, thank you for coming back and clicking on my video and watching. For those of you who clicked on me by accident or the first time here, thanks for coming. Thanks for watching the video. If you learned anything or if I helped you out, if I helped you save any money, comment below. Um, if there's anything that I'm missing or like if there's deals that I don't see and you're seeing in your area, comment below. Um, if you haven't yet subscribed and you like this content and I'm helping you out at all, Hit the like button. Definitely subscribe. I I shop when I can. I work two jobs. I have three kids. So I try and go. Well, I think I go at least twice a week. Um, so if there's anything, any questions you have, uh, anything, deals that you have, um, comment below. And until the next video, happy couponing.